I scrolled through the entire Steam Next Fest library to find all the best games I could coming out in the next year. I will be showing off the top 10 games I have found. If you are new to the channel, welcome in. My name is Band Shredded Cheese, and I'm a streamer and a YouTuber who focus on all things indie games, from tips and tricks to tutorials, reviews, and challenges. This list has the best games I found, but I want to know what games you are excited for. Comment down below what games you want to see me play and make reviews for in the coming months as they are released. Now let's jump right in and see if I already found your future favorite. Favorite. One of the games that has been on my radar for months now is Pacific Drive. This game is a first person survival game built around driving and your car as your only friend. You and your trusty station wagon will be navigating the dangers of the Pacific Northwest. When venturing into the Olympic exclusion zone, a fresh set of tires will not be enough to keep you alive as new challenges will arrive with each trip. An abandoned garage will act as your home base to upgrade your station wagon, enabling you to venture further and further out. You can begin gathering resources and investigating the mysteries of the zone in just a few weeks as this game is releasing on February 22nd of this year. I am thinking about streaming this game on release day, so let me know if I should bring back the YouTube streams. In a world filled with the remains of a shattered civilization and imposing ruins, you will be the final human blessed with a mysterious mask. In Soul Mask, you will battle for survival in a primitive landscape littered with mysterious fates that lay out a guide to ascendance. You will start from nothing and have to explore, build, and recruit others to be your tribesmen to establish a clan. With your clan members, you will be constantly in a survival of the fittest mindset. From other clans to animals of the environment, survival will heavily rely on your leadership. This game also boasts official servers that will be able to hold up to 70 players and could potentially set the stage for content creators to clash head-to-head -head with their communities backing them. There will also be an option for land and private servers for those who would prefer if their only competition was the wilderness they live in. There is no official release date yet, but this game is planned to be available in 2024. This next game you might recognize if you follow me on Twitter and pay attention to my replies. The Unknown is a psychological horror game that dives into the main character's mind. Platforming through tormented thoughts, deadly obstacles, and solving puzzles is just the start of this first-person platformer. This game is not for those who are looking for a cozy way to relax, as you will need to master the precision dodging of deadly saws all while being watched. The sinister narrator of the main character's inner thoughts adds to the atmospheric world, keeping you on a razor's edge the whole time. You can try your hand at escaping The Unknown on March 4th of this year when the full game releases. If you would rather focus on the horrors of war over your inner mind, that Incursion Red River might be your pick. This game takes place in a destabilized and war-torn modern-day Vietnam. Playing with up to three others, this extraction-style first-person shooter has you complete contracts and challenges from different militant groups. Build your guns, playstyle, and reputation as you choose to either play long-range with snipers and stealth or fast-paced running and gunning. This game has built up an impressive story behind a first-person shooter, and the way the story ends will be yours to decide through contracts and results. Think twice about your build and your strategy as quantities are limited for equipment and ammo, not to mention the lives of your squad as well. I am not known for my stellar FPS gameplay, but I look forward to playing this game when its release date is announced. Stepping out of the jungle and into the liminal spaces of Dreamcore, this game brings back the psychological horror and puzzle solving games. This entire game is designed to fit the visual aesthetics of found footage from the 1980s. You will be able to freely explore the puzzles and offer a one of a kind puzzle solving experience. There are many maps with different spaces to explore and each hallway, corner, and room will leave you wondering where you are and if you are alone while searching for the exit. This game has no set release date, but I already know a handful of others, myself included, who are looking forward to getting to check this game out when it does. In an apocalyptic world covered by toxic fog, the next survival game takes place. Serum is not only the name of this game, but the only way to keep yourself alive. You will have to fight not just mutated animals, but also against the clock for survival. There is a unique brewing system to this game that will allow you to modify medicine to be able to better fight against the monsters of the world. You'll be able to fight with clubs, spears, and the trust bow and arrow while attempting to keep track of your health, stamina, and the side effects of your medical concoctions. The constant balance of survival will require you to make life or death decisions. The monsters may not even be your biggest threat as time will march on whether you want it to or not. You will have to defy the odds and beat the clock all while farming the needed resources. You will be able to take on your goal of survival alone or in a co-op playstyle in Q2 of 2024 when this game releases. It's no secret that gamers love trucking simulators, but how would you make a trucking sim and out of this world World adventure? Easy put it in space. Star Trucker takes on the best of the games before it and adds a twist that turns it up to 11 as you navigate the stars. Hauling loads on hyper highways and taking on jobs that could cross light years is just the beginning of your journey. The CB radio will allow you to collect gossip, request docking permission, and even call for help when plans go south. There is a south in space, right? 
Regardless, you'll be able to upgrade and customize your truck to fit your style and allow you to be able to reach the furthest reaches of the universe. There is no official release date yet, but the game is planned to be available in 2024. Keeping with the simulator games, this next pick is the most cozy on the list. Photography Simulator surprised me with its simplistic playstyle and relaxing atmosphere. I am not a professional and cannot speak to the realism, but anyone looking to learn the basics of photography will likely be able to collect some knowledge alongside their photo portfolio. With camera settings like zoom, aperture, focus, and shutter speed, you will need to hone your skills to perfect your art. You will be tasked with setting up a social media account in the game to be able to share your photos and earn an income to afford better equipment. You'll be able to travel across the globe and push your following to the max and earn the most possible. As someone who loves using photo mode in games, Photography Simulator got rid of most of the rest and only kept what I spent way too long doing. Have you ever played Tony Hawk's Pro Skate and thought, man, I wish I was also fighting monsters right now? Well boy do I have a game for you. Hellskate is an action roguelite that combines skateboarding with fighting monsters in a high action and fun game. Attacks on monsters will have you grinding on rails and chaining together combos to power up. From handheld weapons to even your board, you will have all the tools necessary to fight your way through the gods of skating. Being able to do simple tricks is no longer enough, as this game can almost feel souls-like once you add a set of wheels under your feet. Hellskate releases in just a few days on February 15th, but it may be months before I manage to do any of the in-game tricks out in my apartment buildings parking lot. It is no secret I love racing and racing games. From the various things behind me to some of my earliest dreams being racing games, I have always sought out the best racing games everyone can enjoy. Drive Rally is a game I've kept on my radar for a few months now. The 90s style rally cars, the simplistic art style, and the attention to detail have kept me on edge waiting for this game. There are several different environments you will be nearly flying through as you perfect your driving style. You can tailor your car to match your driving style and aesthetic. You'll have to rely on your co-driver the person who rides shotgun to further your experience. Drive Rally might just be that next racing game accessible to even those with weaker computers and laptops with its simple art style and easy to understand controls. There is no official release date yet, but expect to see me putting the pedal to the metal when this game becomes available in 2024. That is all the games I have on my radar for the next year that I found in Steam Next Fest's library. If there's a game you want me to check out on stream or even make a video about, make sure you comment that game down below. And while you wait for these games to come out, you can check out this playlist list of games I have already made reviews for and I will see you next time.